Hello Libra and welcome to Spiritual Wellness Tarot. I thank you for stopping by for your December reading. I feel so grateful Libra that you have chosen Spiritual Wellness Tarot to help with your spiritual journey. Woo! There we go. <laughs> we got our, our first jumper here. So um, go ahead and remember to watch till the end as we will be pulling three cards, three answers to three of your yes or no questions that you have Libra. Now we're going to go ahead and have three rows. We're going to start off with the 1st through the 10th of December. We're going to go ahead and the 11th through the 20th and then the 21st through the 31st. Ooh, we got the tower at the end of the month, right? And actually at the end of the year. Wow, that's crazy, right? Now Libra, for those of you who are new here, my name is Julie and I am a psychic medium here on YouTube. And I use my psychic gifts to go ahead and help encourage those who may be feeling just a little bit lost or might just need a little bit of insight into their future. So let's get this reading started, right Libra? All right, so we're going to start off with the Three of Pentacles, which the Three of Pentacles is about teamwork, right? Collaboration. It might be that you, um, you know, you have a special project going on at work. You're going to have, you're going to have some new teammates. It might be that you, you know, are getting ready for a family get together. Um, so, you know what? Collaboration is always the best way to help move things along. Getting different ideas, different perspectives. You've got the King of Cups underneath that, and the King of Cups is about that supportive leader, right? So this could be, with this Three of Pentacles here, it could be that you're collaborating with a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Libra, that could be a, that could be a possibility. We've got the Nine of Wands here. There's boundaries. There's going to be some boundaries. We always have boundaries, right? But you just need to know what those boundaries are. What can you go ahead and do to move forward but stay within your lane, right? Stay within those boundaries. So definitely um, within this collaboration of what is going on could be love. You know, maybe there'll be a party and you find somebody that you really want to be involved with, right? But whatever it is, know that you there always are some boundaries. So just keep yourself in check. We've got the seven of wands for this for the 10th through the or the 11th through the 20th. The seven of wands is about protecting yourself, right? and competition and just knowing that that energy that you have you can go ahead and let go of any negative thoughts that you have going on competition is normal right competition is normal that's how we learn that's how we grow is through competition so you may have some competition coming up here we've got the page of wands now the page of wands is that active kid they have creative ideas right you might have a new project that's coming up and that would that would go along with this three of pentacles with the collaborations right interesting we have the death card next to the tower something is going to be removed and new is going to come in and i mean that all in a great way right i don't think that something that something that's going to be removed is is something that you really want to hold on to right you have the choice though right you've got the choice of deciding if you want to remove what is not serving you just like in the tower card and bring back in this death card big changes or you want to stay stuck right you can certainly stay stuck but you've got this nine of cups up here which your wishes are coming true, right? You're going to have security. You're going to have material abundance. You're going to have good health. Everything is going your way, Libra. Wonderful reading for December, right? You've got some memories coming up. You've got, um, you know, you may be getting to get together with family or friends and you're going to create good memories. You're going to create some new memories. And again, we've got to go ahead and realize that something may may you know and it could have already happened but somebody something is going to move out of your life and you've just got to realize when the universe takes something out of your life there's a reason for it right i know we've all heard this the little saying when one close when one door closes another one opens it's true when you're in the middle of the situation you want to say well screw you right it's i don't want to hear that but it is true when one door closes another one does open it may take a little bit of time you may have to have some patience but it will happen all right let's get our clarifiers out here we got the eight of cups whoops 
Oh, we've got two there, actually. So let's go here. Oh, we've got the Eight of Cups on top of the Three of Pentacles. We've got the Nine of Cups. What else did we get here? Wow, we got a ton of stuff. Let's get two more cards here. So it looks like you've got some more competition coming. That It looks like, I think that's interesting. What was this one here? This was the Seven of Wands. you got the Seven of Wands and the Five of Wands in the middle of the month. You're going to have some competition, right? You're going to have something, uh, maybe some obstacles, right? Maybe, um, you know, shoot, maybe Aunt Mary can't come to the can't come to the Christmas party, so you need to change things. Or maybe maybe Cousin Joe is throwing a fit and he, he wants something different to happen. It's, you're going to have to go ahead and make some compromises. All right, so let's start off with this Eight of Cups here. These all set up here. So the Eight of Cups, what do we have? Eight of Cups is on top of the Three of Pentacles. The Eight of Cups is about just going and being by yourself, right? Withdrawing. You might feel a little bit disappointed, right? But you don't need to, right? You don't have to have that feeling. You have the choice to go ahead because you know now that we've done our reading for the, you know, for the end of the month here, you know what is not serving you is going to go ahead and move forward. And you have those options to accept the goodness and release the the badness if that's a word brad badness <laughs> but you have the you have that option you've got the nine of cups right underneath the eight of cups right and the nine of cups you've got actually twice right so and this is why i do two i use two sometimes three decks when the universe wants us to to know something right they kind of knock us on the head when we're doing these readings because they come out twice right so we've got the nine of cups twice this is beautiful libra this is so wonderful your wishes are coming true your health is very very good you are feeling very secure i just love this great reading for you we've got the seven of swords and did we not just have the seven of swords somewhere else maybe not Oh, it's the Seven of Wands. Okay, so we've got the Seven of Swords. And the Seven of Swords is about you want to run away, right? You And it's interesting that we've got this in the same week, right? The same 10 days with the Eight of Cups. You're feeling a little defeated, right? Just like this Eight of Cups. But there is no reason to, Libra. There's no reason to. You've got this Nine of Cups twice, right? So you are going to go ahead and and come out of this unscathed, right? You are gonna be leading. You are gonna be that strong, strong person. We've got the Three of Swords. The Three of Swords, a lot of people think is bad, right? But it is about a heartbreak. It's about loss. It's about depression and things. You have, I think it's interesting that it's right next to the Eight of Cups. You have the choice to get out of there, right? It might be that whatever is being removed here, just like in the Tower and the Devil, it's going to turn out to be okay. You're going to be okay, Libra. We've got the five of wands competition, right? We talked about that. Challenges, obstacles, competition. You're going to have them, right? But you know what? That's how we learn. That's how we become stronger. That's how we just have that feisty confidence. We've got the six of wands. Victory, right? Whatever your competition is that you had here, you're going to come out victorious. You're going to go ahead and say, hey, I did it, right? I went ahead and accepted the responsibility, and I am strong. I am victorious. We've got the King of Pentacles here, and, and he is that wise leader, right? He's a wise investor also, right? You might be doing some investing over the, over the holiday week. Um, you know, something might, um, come, might pop up, right? Uh, maybe Bitcoin will, will go down, and you buy a bunch, and it moves up. I don't know, but... <laughs> Something is going to go ahead and bring you into that wise investor mode. We've got the Hierophant here. He's all about traditions, right? He's all about, he loves being with people. He wants to go ahead and move forward. And you're going to be building up some traditions. And interesting how it comes on top of the Six of Cups, which is about traditions also. This week or this 10 days, the 21st through the 31st, you're going to be building some traditions, right? You're going to be getting together with the family, maybe. Uh, maybe you're going to go to, if you're if you're home alone, away from the family, maybe you're going to go to a movie and start a new tradition and going to the movies every Christmas, right? So something is going to happen there. You're going to start a new tradition. And then we've got the Four of Cups on top of this tower. The Four of Cups is about surprises, right? 
end of the end of the month and this is actually going to be end of the year right guys i think this is so so interesting libra end of the month end of the year something is going to be removed what is not serving you and all you need to do is accept the surprise libra and life is going to be grand right you've got the ten of cups you got the nine of cups you got the um you got you know your wishes are coming true i love this i just love this libra great reading right just a great reading all right libra um remember to go ahead and watch your sun moon and rising signs so you can get that overall energy for yourself and go ahead and start thinking about that first yes or no question first answer is peaceful resolution okay so that's a great one right that's that's compromising right that's um that's realizing that you know you can go ahead and have that peaceful resolution second answer is abundance love it right just love it all right and go ahead and um, think about your third question and remember libra to go ahead and smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell if this reading does resonate with you and your last one is trust trust yourself libra right it's okay to trust your trust your intuition i know you like to be a book smart and you like to be very intellectual and make plans but trust yourself libra trust yourself great reading libra i love you all and until next time namaste